Hi, I'm Daisy. This is my beauty's big sister channel. And I'm not gonna lie, I was out partying last night. So I'm a little bit tired, don't feel great. So I'm not gonna do a tutorial. I'm going to talk to you about my favorite products this month. So first up is this Body Shop Drops of Youth Bouncy Sleeping Mask. And oh my God, it is amazing. It literally, the texture of it is so cool. It is like a mattress, a bit like Play-Doh. You just want to play with it all day, but it feels so nice on your skin. So all you need to do is put it on your skin before you go to bed at night and sleep in it. And it just makes your skin feel so smooth, so soft, and like you've had like a million hours sleep. So if you are having a late night and you're not feeling great, then put this on your skin before you go to bed and it will feel incredible in the morning. I've got sensitive skin and it's been fine with my skin, but obviously maybe just try it on a little patch before you go full out if you do have sensitive skin. Next is this Vita Liberata Naked Skin Matte Wash Off Instant Tan and I've been using this medium shade. I've been mixing this in with my moisturiser just for a lighter coverage because it is quite a thick formula so it does make you go really brown but it's a really good shade of brown, it isn't orange at all so it looks like you've just been away on holiday which is great and yeah I've been using this when I've been going out at night so I've just put this on my legs and my arms and then it just washes off when you shower. It's really good fake tan, I really like it. So it's from the, the makers of Vita Liberata. And uh, Naked Skin is just basically like a cheaper variant of the Vita Liberata tans because they are quite expensive. But I really, really like Naked Skin. As I've said before, my hair is quite thin and it does get a little bit dry at the ends. So I've been using this Organics Macadamia Oil Dry Styling Oil. This has got macadamia oil in it, which means it smells really good, but it also is really good for treating dry hair. All I've been doing is putting this on the ends of my hair. You only need like a tiny drop, so this literally lasts for ages. Um, so you need a tiny drop and just put it on the ends of your hair once you've blow dried it, and it'll make it feel really nice and soft and smooth. Roller Lash, I put this in my video last week, and I have been using it ever since. It is so good and I will definitely be buying another one once it's run out. It's such a good mascara, especially for lengthening. You might find that you need a couple of coats before you get a really volumised look and thickened lashes. But it's really good for lengthened lashes and I love it. I never thought that I'd be putting a concealer brush in a favourites video, but this is absolutely genius. This is the Rule Techniques Concealer Brush. I've never really used a specific concealer brush to apply my concealer because I didn't really think you needed one. You can kind of use your fingers, your foundation brush or your blending sponge, but this I will always use now to apply my concealer because it makes such a difference to your look. After applying this underneath my eye, like the concealer just goes on a bit thicker, you're getting better coverage and it's just more flawless, it gives you a really nice finish and it's really good as well if you've got any spots or blemishes because it's amazing for covering those up. Another thing that I've been loving this month is this Nivea Lip Butter in Blueberry Blush. I've had really bad cracked dry lips for ages and I tried loads of different lip balms to try and help it. I tried Blistex, I used loads and none of them helped and then I tried this and my lips are so smooth now. It's a really nice buttery texture and it has also got a really nice pinky purpley tint so it looks lovely on your lips and it also tastes really good which helps. In a lot of my videos lately I have been putting Rodeo products in there because Everything in the range is just amazing. I've been loving it. And this has been my saviour as well. This is, I can't even tell what it's called anymore because I have worn it so much and used it so much that all the packaging's gone away. But I think it's the Rodial Retouch Concealer. And it's got like illuminating particles in it. So it's really good for using underneath your eyes and also highlighting your face. So 
here, above my cheekbone, chin, cupid bow, down my nose. It's really good and I've been blending it in with my concealer brush. And my last product, which is my absolute favourite, this is the I Heart Makeup Naked Palette. I have basically worn this every day this month and I've got my friends to wear it, I've applied it on my mum, on my aunties and you can tell why I love it because the colours are just beautiful and very me and the pigment is amazing. If you put it on in the morning it will not wear off. I did do a tutorial a couple of weeks ago using this palette because I love it so much um, but I really wanted to put it in this video again because I think that not many people know how good price it is, you just look at it and think it's really expensive but actually it's £8 which is incredible for the quality you're getting and the packaging, it's too cute. So that's all the products I've been loving this month, I'm now going to go to bed and have a couple of hours sleep um, but I hope you enjoyed this video and if there's anything that you want me to do a tutorial on then put it in the comments below and make sure you're subscribed. See you next Sunday, bye!